reports first day attendance not all. This is the great What a sight from the ground cameras and starters. We're flying at twice the thrust of the Saturn V heading this way. Officer Jones, the Gulf of Christie. Throttle down and throttle back up. Going through the period of maximum aerodynamic pressure. As the velocity increases, the depth of the atmosphere is decreasing. Lessening stress on the vehicle. The call out, Max Q now. Continuing to watch the first stage as we head down range. Hundred seconds into flight. Our next major activity is going to be shut down of the first stage. Again, quiet here. Houston tracking station now acquiring the vehicle. With shutdown, we will get separation of Starship and Starship Heavy and ignition of the Starship engines. And if Starship separates, we light up six engines in a staggered sequence. And if all goes well, those six engines Standing will burn for almost six Jettison, and a half minutes. Onboard view from Starship. And there's views of the Raptor engines on the second stage. As we prepare for stage separation, confirmation that the solid After rocket boosters have separated. The we'll These 177 foot boost boosters. Maneuver for landing in the Gulf. Now the core stage continues to power the flight of Orion. All four RS-25 engines firing, traveling over 3,400 miles per hour, 46 miles downrange. Continuing to fly. Two minutes, 40 Two seconds. Minutes and 36 Let's get seconds ready for main engine flight. cutoff. Hearing nominal calls here in Mission Control, Houston. We've still got four good engines on the four stage. stage. Next up, we'll be looking for the service module fairing to separate. This is three 15 by 15 foot fairing panels, providing structural support, protecting the service module. It will separate it about three minutes and 11 seconds into flight, and very shortly thereafter will be followed by the launch abort system separation. Just over three minutes into the flight of Artemis 1, now traveling over 4,060 miles per hour, 83 miles downrange. We just had confirmation that the service module fairing has separated. As of right now, we are awaiting stage separation. Where Starship should separate from And that the launch abort system pyros have fired, booster. separating those from Orion as well. For future crew members. Yeah, Kate, right now it looks like we saw the start of the flip, but obviously we're seeing from the ground cameras the entire Starship stack continuing to rotate. We should have had separation by now. Obviously, this is uh, does not appear to be a nominal situation. Yeah, it does appear to be spinning, but I do want to remind everyone that everything after clearing the tower was icing on the cake. 